Hi everybody, I'm Ashley and you're kicking it with Ash. I know a lot of you guys are like, where have you been? I haven't seen you in a minute. And I know and I understand and I respect the question, okay? Um, I was working on something and so that is why I had to step away, unfortunately, again on YouTube. But I'm back full force. I was able to publish my planner and my college guidebook on Amazon. So if you haven't got your copy, go pick it up today so that way we can start January on the same boat. But I really came here to talk to you guys about 2021 and recapping 2021. My good friend asked me yesterday, Ashley, what was your growth for 2021 and what was my glow up? Um, obviously, my glow up came about my self-confidence, um, my weight loss, but really just me being happy with who I am inward and outward and not letting anyone tell me otherwise that was my glow up like if you hadn't seen the confidence this year bitch is there i know who i am i won't allow anybody to come in but it took the growth it took a guy to show me that i'm worth more than what he was doing displaying he had me in a mental cage I'm not going to lie. I was in that mental cage. For a long time. It was this year. I'm not going to lie. It probably cleared up in November. Um, I left him alone. Physically. March, April. Last time I spoke with him was May. Um, but it's the process. It's the process of getting that person out of your energy. It's the process of what did i do even though sometimes you may have done nothing um the process of am i good enough so it was a it, i was trapped in a mental cage but due to the gym due to pole due to TikTok, due to you youtube i was able to keep moving forward despite the fact that i was in a mental cage and that allowed me to glow up that allowed me to say hey we're gonna put this bitch on my back and we're gonna keep moving he gonna come out and bother me and I gotta process that, but keep moving. My job kept me moving. My students kept me moving. When I had to quit my job, TikTok kept me moving. The gym kept me moving. Pole Fitness kept me moving. And more importantly, my friends kept me moving. And then just loving on myself tied it all together. So 2021 was all about finding me again, centering myself in me, Staying grounded in me, but definitely staying in the word. When I say I increased um, my prayer, how many times I pray, my gratitude. Um, I don't do nothing without asking God. I don't. If I don't have a conversation with him, I'm just not sure if I'm going to do it. And I'm okay with that because my walk with God with him is totally different than your walk with him if you are having that walk with him but just know for me he has been here next to me this whole time just telling me i got you and it's going to be okay and i had to lean on him because as humans it's hard to lean on each other it really is and for me it's really hard to lean on other people but it's not hard for me to call on God. So 2021 was me refining myself, centering myself, grounding myself. So that way when I move into 2022, I won't allow the things that happened in 21 or in the past to come in 2022. So with that being said, you guys be on the lookout for a new video for the new year, starting off for with why should I go to college? point blank period we're gonna start with why should you go to college okay and then from there we're gonna break it down so if you haven't got the college guide or the 12 month planner go get your copy so that way we can start on the same page other than that you guys i hope your 2021 was great i hope you made goals for 2022 but if anything just know that i love you and i adore you and i only wish you the best going into 2022 have a great day you guys bye